ever since I lost to Big Sexy, people have been asking, Hurt, where have you been? I'll tell you where I've been. working to make sure that what happened never happens again. You talking about losing? Losing a match? No. Because I'm going to lose matches. I've been telling people hypocritically that if you want more, you have to do more. But what you people are Having to understand is, I don't ask anything of you that I don't demand of myself. PWR is the number one company in the world. And I've been treating it as such. And I used to be the number one competitor in the world. And I haven't been dedicating myself the way I should. If I'm gonna compete with the number one roster in the world, I got complacent. And from the looks of things, a lot of you did too. I took John for granted. I got complacent. Ian told me the truth and I missed it. And the truth was that it, the only thing that matters is in the ring. The promos are nice. The accolades are nice. People coming to me saying, yo, your tweets are going, they're going platinum, they're going viral. That's all wonderful. But when you lose, what are you left with? I sat and watched while a lot of you sat and watched. Opportunity was there for everybody and they just kind of held hands and nobody wanted to go with each other and everybody's waiting for someone else to make another move. It's hard to watch. And I realize I've been doing the same thing. I can't leave better if I don't do better. Then, Scotty unwraps this beautiful new belt. And the whole attitude changes. Disappointment. That's what you're left with. It's not a feeling I'm used to. I'm not in the position I'm used to being in. It's a humbling experience. And I needed it. Because now I'm focused. I haven't felt like this in a long time. Because in this day and age, in 2023, people still think that Titles give them validation. This is where it starts. The hard work. Y'all had that work ethic. And part of that's my fault. And that's a mistake I'll be looking to correct. I'll see you soon.